Um, I'd say special effects at the moment because mm -hmm. of the season that we're in and the course that I'm doing is mainly on special effects. But I definitely like fashion, uh, catwalks, editorial, film. I'm definitely all over the industry type of person. So for the superhero turns into a villain, mm. I created my own character called The Light. And what she'll be is a, a completely matte white uh, like creature, mm. um, slip back white hair but loose at the back. Um, and what happens is she gets into an accident with a villain and then she gets turned into darkness. So I'll add special effects called Full as Earth um, onto the skin and create black areas. This is where the darkness will take over the light area. So um, I wanted to do something like unusual and avant garde and creative because with makeup, it's not about getting a superhero that's already been done, it's about creating your own. I mean, um, I do really enjoy fashion and editorial, but at the minute, as I've just started my level six BA honours, I am getting more into prosthetics and special effects. I'm finding a, quite um, a love with that side of makeup, so I want to like go more into it in my makeup um, experience. So with the um, superhero into villain, I've gone for more of a pop art kind of superhero. When I was doing my research, I found that Wonder Woman was made into pop art a lot of the time. So I've kind of gone into doing pop art, making the face more 3D, but actually making it into a superhero with being Wonder Woman, but turning it into a villain, um, I've done it so like, just one side of her face is turning into the villain. So you can still see that she's um, there is a nice side of her but she's turning into um, a villain by using full as her. so what I was doing is just doing one area of her face and also going into body art onto her chest and the side of her arm and also using that product on her arm so it shows that she's cracking because that effect the effect of that product's cracked so I wanted to see like this this villain's cracking out of her um, inner body because um, on, on my design sheet I've also done with the pop, pop art side that there's actually a tear coming down of down her eye and I want, to, I want it to show emotion that she's actually upset at the fact that she's turning into this villain so I want it to like tell a bit of a story by just looking at the design yeah, that I've done. My specialism is special effects on a budget because I'm skinned <laughs> so I've got to get creative. <laughs> so for the face chart I want to do Gamora. Mm. I've done a face chart but make her like burn really like she's got a couple of scars but really like open those scars up make it like sort of beautiful but like oh, kind of look. What's your name, hun? It's Jade. What's your specialism? I specialise in avant-garde and additional media. Fab. Have you got any ideas for any of the rounds coming up? Um, yeah, I've got ideas for a bride, hmm. a pretty bride, turning into zombie bride. <laughs> <laughs> What's your name, hun? Lauren Tafe. What's your specialism? Additional media. Have you got any ideas for any of the rounds? Uh, I'm going to think about that over the next couple of weeks. It's Louise. And what's your specialism? My specialism is in TV and uh, film, but also a bit of special effects. As well, I do get a bit of inspiration from my children who are self-obsessed with, you know, Marvel, superheroes, villains, and I wanted to do this for them, to help them show them and just a bit of jazz it up, a bit out of the box, be someone different, be yourself. Well, the ideas at the moment, I was thinking, um, round the bridal, looking around down, you know, the groom and changing a groom into someone, you know, handsome, then doing it really like, you know, nasty and like ready and raw. Then for the next round, I'd have to go back and just have a little thing out the box, because we're looking different and just, again, people are be inspired by and other artists that will inspire me within that um, profession. So, what are your names? <laughs> I'm Lisa. Fab. What are your specialisms? I like doing a bit of everything, but I came in kind of wanting to do fashion and TV, but now I like being a bit more inventive and like artsy because I've come from like an artsy background. Awesome. Yeah, mine's like additional media and glam makeup as well. I think for like the hero town villain, mm. I'm going to take a clown. You know, like as a kid, you have clowns as like a party kind of entertainer, and then as you get older, Everyone starts getting a bit scared of clowns. I love them because I love Halloween, so I'm gonna try and do that. Awesome. You got any ideas, one? Um, I just want to do like some. Um, I've not picked which superhero yet, but I want to do like really fierce, like scary, like smoky eyes and stuff. Mm. So, yeah. Fantastic. Fantastic.
Beads make fun and special effects. Yeah. Yeah, I've um, already made a life cast of my face and then I've made a prosthetic on top of it of venom, you know, the superhero. So I've like made the tongue and the teeth and everything. And, like, I'm just going to peel it off and apply it to the face and apply a ball cap. And then I'm going to make a Spider Man one. But I'm going to do it like not like the typical Spider Man sort of one that already looks like venom so you can get the feel of it. But I've not made that yet because it takes a while. Oh, fab. So what are your kind of hopes and dreams? Like when you leave college, what, what do you think is the next step for you? Um, well, I think I want to go into TV and mm -hmm. film because I've grown up around it, so I really like the idea of it. If not, I'll probably just do another course. That's what I hope to do. But Fantastic. Specialism? Um, doing special effects and fashion and makeup. Um, I was thinking something a bit more realistic, so like a police officer getting an acid attack and then, you know, trying to get revenge and stuff like that. Yeah. Um, what are your hopes and dreams or what would you like to do after college? Um, I definitely want to do TV. It's always been like an aim of mine to you know, go to the cinema like, and then at the end of the cinema where no one can it, so yeah, I see my name up there. Um, um, special effects, mainly, yeah. Um, what would you like to do after college? Um, I want to work in like TV and film. Like my dream would be to like work in like Hollywood films. Like I really love like Marvel films and stuff like that. So I'd love to like work on stuff like that one day. So I think that's What's your name, hon. <laughs> <laughs> What's your specialism? Um, specialism. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, I'm gonna do like a faded face, so that the hero and the super. Oh, no, no, no. What, are, what are your dreams for after college? Sorry. Um, I really want to do something like Americans. What's your name, hon? Um, Shanice. What's your specialism? Um, I like doing special effects because I've been doing a bit of that and I do enjoy it. But like, what I really like is more like fashion editorial side. Um, avant-garde, so going absolutely crazy, doing whatever I want to do. Fab. Yeah. Um, what do you want to do after college? Um, I want to like go and like pursue a career in fashion. So my dream would be to go to London, study further there. Um, so yeah. Right. What's your name, hon? Okay, my name is Caitlin Worthington, and um, I want to be a special effects makeup artist, and I really want to experience makeup in different cultures. So I want to travel the world, and I want to just experience it in as much way as I can because I love it. <laughs> what's your name, hon? Chloe. And what's your specialism? Um, I do media makeup at Salford. Oh. What do you want to do after college? Um, I want to have a gap year, but then I eventually want to go to uni. Cool. <laughs> what do you want to do at uni? Do you know yet? Or? Uh, just take media makeup. What's your name, hon? Eloise. And what's your specialism? Special. <laughs> what do you want to do after college, hon? Um, go down like, the special effect route and like work in studios and theatre. And what's your specialism? I would say fashion and special effects. Okay, cool. What do you want to do after college? Uh, I'd love to work on fashion shoots and movie productions. And what's your specialism? Special effects and fashion makeup. What do you want to do after college? Hopefully go into freelance makeup, build my own business and specialism. Um, like glam and go, like glam and go, like a bit like special effects, but a bit of glam as well. Hmm, awesome. What would you like to do after college? Um, try and get into as much um, like films programs as much like American Horror Story so far. What's your name, hon? Alicia. And what's your specialism? Uh, I like doing special effects. I love the blood and guts and all that sort of stuff. Awesome. What do you want to do after college? I like to go on film sets, photo shoots, just anything really. And what's your specialism? Special effects. Have you got any ideas for cosplay? Um, yeah, I've done a pumpkin that's like inspired by Venom and then a hero which is they're like the same person on those together and they call it trick and treat. What do you want to do after college? Um, hopefully work on films and do special effects.